here's this monstrosity I'm getting on. I did uh, seven minutes right now. You guys, it is about to kill me. Look at that. I'm about to get back on it, so. All right, back to work. Tightening those thighs. So this is only 15 minutes and look at the sweat, okay? Yeah. It's important when you're wearing a lace wig and uh, you have it here down with tape or even liquid adhesive to have a band around your hairline so that uh, the sweating, when it gets underneath the, the tape or the, um, the liquid adhesive, it is going to lift a little bit. Your headband is there to keep it secure and in place so that when you cool down, it will reseal. Trust me, I've done this a lot. And um, and you guys, look, I'm sweating pretty hard, okay? So, and this is only 15 minutes into the exercise. So, definitely want to, um, uh, this part right here was lifting even before I left home, so... Don't worry about that, but this part over here was down really well, so I'm, I'm cons you know, really concerned making sure that this stays down with my headband, all right? So, okay, time for me to get back into my exercise. Talk to you later. You like it? I like that class. We like the, what was the name of it? Mom, stop. What was the name of it? We're do I'm doing fit and fab, that's it. What's the name of the class? Body, oh, we did hip hop. What's it? Fitness. Hip hop fitness. As you guys can see, I am sweating and my lace wig stayed on, you guys. No lifting. And I just have it on with tape. Oh boy, and look how I'm sweating. Alright. That was a great class. And I hung in there for the whole hour. Kind of sore. <laughs> my baby. She did so good. I'll cut her out then. All right, you guys. Well, I just finished my hip hop fitness class. My daughter. Did. All right, you guys. I'm done. I'm gonna sit here and wait for my daughter to finish the um, what's it called? Midnight Pilates. What's it called? What's that about? Yeah, candlelight yoga. She's getting ready to do candlelight yoga, and I'm going to take a zero. I'm going not very strong in the arms and wrist area, so doing the dog work, whatever it's called, is not good for me. Alright, bye. <laughs>one set of eights you guys and um, I try to do a lot of leg exercising because my legs are still pretty good shape for a 53 year old I think so I'll probably go over there and start doing some of those uh, I'm not sure what they're called <laughs> but they're great for like a total body workout I like their slogan I'm sexy and I know it I work out <laughs> and their other slogan is exercise like you're going to meet your ex <laughs>
So you want to look good so he can see what he missed out on. They're right now doing the candlelight yoga. I don't know if you guys can see in there. It's kind of reflective. But that's why I'm whispering because they're doing candlelight yoga. So it's supposed to be really nice and soothing and just kind of stretching, which is probably where I need to be. But my wrist and shoulders are not... Um, what I need them to be to do some of those poses and I end up hurting myself worse so I stick with what I know I stick with what I can do in my reign you know in my realm of things and uh, I try not to go outside of my comfort zone so that looks That looks doable what they're doing in there now. I can do that probably. Maybe not. That's a, a good balancing act right there. I'll probably be on my booty by now trying to hold that pose. That's why I hurt my knees. My knees are not very strong. I have to have a towel. Oh God, I hate that when you have the pulse. She's got great balance. All right, so this is my day of exercising. This is Monday night. I'll come back in the morning. They have a Zumba class I'm going to take. And I may take the Body Rock class again. That was a nice class. It's with weights. I know I felt it in my neck and my shoulders. I think in my neck because I used to weight and rested it on my neck which probably wasn't a good idea. And so my neck my neck was really sore the next day or maybe a day after. And so um, I know that not to rest the weights on my neck, but my shoulders again. I, I have a frozen shoulder on my left side, so trying to hold that weight is not good for me, even though it was just the bar and five pounds. It was pitiful, really. This is our teacher. She is so cute. And she's the owner of this gym. And um, I'm really enjoying this class. So I'll talk to you guys later. This is the lady. And I am getting fit and fabulous at 50. Bye.